OMG, federal judge gives 12 hours to Biden administration to publish Harry's fake visa and deport him out of the U.S. Hello, truth seekers, and welcome back to our channel, where we reveal the shocking truth behind the glamorous world of Prince Harry and Meghan Markle. Ladies, grab your popcorn because I'm back with the hottest gossip that'll make you grab your sexiest self and clutch your pearls so tight they might shatter. So a federal judge finally upped the ante and put the petite prince on a short-term lease related to his shady immigration status. This is the moment we've all been waiting for. But before we dive into the tumultuous waters of this reveal, if you haven't done me a favor by hitting that subscribe button and turning on the notification bell, you might want to do that. You won't want to miss out on this explosive content we have in store. Following them to the end means appreciating their legacy, understanding their journey, and continuing the inspiration that they left us. Let's honor their memories together and cherish every moment. Let's start the video now. So, for years, this spoiled brat lived in our country like a famous oligarch, swanning about this Montecito mansion, making millions off of truth bombs peddling from his family, while gleefully violating our federal laws with impunity. While the arrogant illusion of American privilege are about to collapse in spectacular fashion, according to reports, a group of grassroots conservative think tanks somehow outmaneuvered high-ranking cronies of the Biden regime in the court battles. Can you believe that? These warrior wizards actually forced a federal judge to order the release of Harry's sketchy visa paperwork within just 12 hours, fully preparing the cargo planes, ready to take off. This is what you get when you blatantly tout the rules and defy the legal authorities like some aristocratic Hollywood aristocrat. Harry, the joke finally came after your self-admission admitting to drug use in that puzzling memoir that backfired spectacularly. I would love to see the panic and fear spread across your smug face right now. For years, the administration's Department of Homeland Security lackeys have brazenly turned a blind eye while their famous idols paraded around breaking every immigrant statue on the books, all because they yearn to get to know neighboring elites and avoid any resistance from their cognitively liberal media entertainment complex. But now the rooster has finally come home to roost to be a law-abiding taxpayer. We deserve complete transparency about how on earth a substance abuse like Harry was able to game the system to secure residency here. Did he lie on his job application? Could it be that corrupt officials simply waived their drug rap sheet to wake up the royal family? We're about to find out how this appalling arrangement by federal agents of Harry's brazen crime needs to be eliminated and punished to the fullest extent of the law. There is no more special treatment for liberal elites. Gone are the double standards that celebrities enjoy when countries violate their own sovereign borders without consequences. Not on my watch. Not not on the big movement's track. Donald Trump himself would ask for nothing more than the swift deportation of unhinged alien immigrants who oppose our country's immigration policies. And in an election year, Biden simply cannot afford any more explosive scandals surrounding wealthy liberals gaming the system. So you know what that means. If not a literal act of divine intervention, there are only a few days left before the Biden regime will break off this deadlocked relationship and revoke his residency outright completely. Mark my words, the wheels towards deportation are already turning in Washington behind closed doors. So what do you think about this news? Sound off in the comments, let me know what you think. Stay tuned for more shocking stories and revealing scandals on our YouTube channel. Remember to like, share, and subscribe to stay updated with the latest information from the royal world. Thank you so much for watching. We'll see you again with some more juicy royal news.